Well, back to school, meaning kids and parents will be swimming a lot less. Our Jane Davenport spoke with the Lexington Fire Department on what this past summer looked like and what they did to help protect and save people's lives. The Lexington Fire Department responding to four drownings these past few summer months. It's one of those unfortunate circumstances where someone may get in the water that is a capable swimmer. Uh, but things do occur. Uh, people have medical emergencies. They are overcome by the water. They don't think uh, exactly how far away they are from the shore. Compared to last summer. There has definitely been an increase in drownings. Uh, as far as any particular cause for that, we can't have not been able to identify one. Some factors that contribute to drownings include not wearing a life vest, leaving small kids unattended, and Specifically here in Fayette County, we do have quite a few springs underwater that can produce uh, small currents, but anytime that there's wind, even on a static source of water like a lake or a pond, it's going to produce movement within the water. Uh, and on some of the reservoirs in this area off the Richmond Road corridor, water trades back and forth between reservoirs. So that current you may not see on the top is actually trading on the lower part of the water back and forth between the reservoirs. Captain Runnels adding that no matter how good of a swimmer you are, there are so many other factors that can make the water dangerous. But the Lexington Fire Department says they're always operating in rescue mode when they get that call for a possible drowning. So we're going to deploy boats out to the water source. Uh, we're going to get, we have uh, two different sonar units that we're going to start scanning the area with and finding that witness to see the point last seen of that person before they went underwater. From there, they deploy their divers. The Lexington Fire Department has anywhere from 40 to 50 certified divers that rescue and find people in the water. And while the warm weather continues, Captain Runnels urges people to be safe around the water, even if you're a good swimmer. In Lexington, Jane Davenport, ABC 36 News Now.